The gospel of Jesus Christ is the solution to the woes of man. How much of it you know, determines how well you reign in life. Join us. At Shepherd's Love Worldwide, opposite top radio, circle across, as the man of God, Apostle Johnsburg, takes us through sound teaching, and instruction in the word, Shepherd's Love Worldwide, making Christ prominent, in our generation. And now, the man of God, Apostle Johnsburg. Please, the first point is, the gospel is God's love story, or letter to the whole world. Okay. Point two, the gospel is what saves men, mm. or it is God's method of saving the world. Point three, Jesus Christ is the same, is the same theme of the gospel point four jesus secured eternal salvation for the believer point five believing the gospel is vital point six First point six. The gospel is who we, we see who we are in the gospel and where we have come to. We see who we are in the gospel and where we have come to. I said we have been doing ten points now. Over ten weeks. Ah, I thought you were saying ah. So I'm like, hey, well, ah, I'm checking my notes to see whether I really ah. Yeah, hey, some more. So okay, let's let's go. So that's point one. Point six. Okay, so point seven. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. Point seven. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. Let's look at Second Corinthians chapter five, verse twenty and twenty-one. Second Corinthians chapter five, verse twenty and twenty-one. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. Can we please have that? 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 20 and verse 21. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. Yeah. The Bible says, Now then, we are ambassadors for Christ. As though God were pleading through us, we implore you on Christ's behalf be reconciled to god now then we are ambassadors for christ who are we this 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 even one of the points who we are if we are to do that we'll do that many many weeks <laughs> the gospel reveals who we are you see one of the, the the points we are ambassadors who is an ambassador no not just a representative if you just say a representative a legal representative Okay, that but you have missed another point of a government. Of a government. Do you know that there are many Ghanaians living in the US, but only one person has been mandated to speak for the government of Ghana? Whatever they are saying is an opinion. It's their own personal view they might be sharing. If you go to let's say the US, I'm using the US. If you go to the US now and you go to a place like bronze and you see many many people many Ghanaians, and you interview them what do you think about so and so what do you think and they all give their they all say something whatever they are saying is an opinion is their personal opinion they are sharing but if you want to know what the government thinks what the government feels there's somebody there called an ambassador he is the one legally mandated by the government of ghana he is the one he is the one who speaks for everybody to listen He's like the, 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 the extension of the president of Ghana in that place. Do you know that? Yes, sir. Now, and one, one thing ambassadors enjoy is immunity. They are immune. The, the U.S. ambassador to Ghana, when you go to the United States embassy at Cantonment, it is as though he's living in the U.S. in Ghana. Do you know that? Yes, sir. 
it is as, like the the condition the atmosphere everything is the u.s it's like they have carried u.s to ghana what is happening in ghana does not affect him what is happening this these are basic how these international relations these are basic the government of ghana has no rights to go to the u.s embassy and do anything you don't have any rights it is like he's the small president do you get it he enjoys everything and guess what he's okay you work in the embassy so you understand it well the ambassador don't doesn't he communicate with the mexican government he receives instruction from them not from ghana government everything he needs is supplied from mexico everything he needs his home government is the one who takes care of him he's just living here working here do you get it? if he needs anything sometimes you may even go to where they live and realize that they have foreign their country products there you may go to their home and see the milk is not it is still the u.s milk u.s everything it is as though he's in ghana but it's as though he's still in the u.s that's who an ambassador is and he has immunity the systems of ghana does not control him you can't judge him with the laws of ghana do you do you get it yes, and now the Bible says, we too, we are what? Ambassadors for Christ. The believer and the unbeliever are never the same. No. Never. You cannot use car as a basis. You cannot use money as a basis. No, the one who has believed in Jesus and the one who has not believed, they are never the same. They may all look like, oh, we are all human beings, but they are never the same. He said, we are ambassadors for Christ. It means that it means that as long as we are in this world it also speaks of provision and immunity also if they can be providing for the u.s ambassador it means that our home government which is heaven will also be taking care of us that's why you don't live by the economy you don't say you don't follow them those on the street they are shouting oh the economy is hard though now they're suffering now they're, you are also you have also ab adopted that talking and you think oh mm, let's give what belongs to caesar you are handing over your life to the devil you see life is full of ups and downs no challenges will come challenges will come as for that one he has told us in his word though challenges will come but you see he said god is a present help in times of trouble he said the, the name of the lord is a strong tower the righteous run it they're in and they are safe so if we are truly ambassadors it means that our home government would cater for us that's one it means that we are immune to the conditions of the world we are immune we have immunity we have immunity we have immunity we have immunity, we have immunity. this is why you see we are over and above the systems of the world Hallelujah. over and above over and never above. accept it over and above, above. you use the same word we are ambassadors for christ it means it, it, uh, another thing i mentioned was that the ambassador is the one legally mandated to speak for a government it means that we are the ones legally mandated to speak for jesus now are we ambassadors for christ okay as though god were pleading through us as though god was doing what it is as though when we step out when we are ministering to people it's as though god is through us pleading to other people we implore you on christ's behalf be reconciled to god this is the ministry we have the ministry of reconciliation the ministry he has given us is not condemnation condemnation is coming say you you did not do it like how the devil comes and says look at look at a sinner look at this guy that's condemnation we have a ministry called the ministry of reconciliation and in this ministry say so when we come we tell the people be reconciled to god you see god has done everything all he needs is to have the world to himself and how does he do that men have to hear the gospel we have dealt with it over some of the points men have to, the gospel is god's method of saving the world men have to hear the gospel it says through us 
we, we tell the people be reconciled to God. That's what we do. That's what we do. That's what we do. So you're a minister, you're an ambassador. You're an ambassador. I always tell you that what, what you what you do, what you do, you say I'm a banker. I'm a secondary to who you are. A secondary to who you are in Christ Jesus. Oh, an architect. Uh, those those ones are temporal things. Oh, who you are is permanent. Who you are is permanent. Look, it so says ambassadors for Christ, as though God were pleading through us. We implore you on Christ's behalf. Be reconciled to God. Verse 21. For he made him. Uh -huh, we are coming to the point. The gospel reveals the gift of righteousness. For he made him. That is God made Jesus. For he made him. Who knew no sin to be sin for us. Jesus who knew no sin. Became sin for us. Why? With God all things are possible. <laughs> that, that's it. He didn't know sin. But yet, he became sin. And he became sin not for himself. He became sin for us. For us. So I always say that, if you don't know why Jesus came the first time, you have no business saying he is coming again. Because he, is, he will come again on the premise of what he came to do. The first time. Jesus will come again or he will come again. You see, but he's going to come again on the premise of what he came to do the first time. So you have to be busy knowing about what he came to do. So he says, he made him who knew no sin to be sin for us. That we might become the righteousness of God in him. Hallelujah. You see, two equations. He said, he made Jesus who knew no sin to be sin for us. It means that Jesus didn't become a sinner. Jesus became sin. Sin itself. It means on that cross, it, on that cross, people were seeing a human being. But it, that was sin on the cross. You see, outwardly they thought, ah, yes, a guy, we have got him. This guy, we show him. You, We have looked for you, sir. Today, today you go see Pepe. They used to sing this song. He said, we go, we go score you. We go put pepper in your eyes. They were singing it to Jesus. I, I, I'm sure. I'm sure they were singing it to him. We go lash you. We go put pepper in your eyes. On the cross. Outwardly, here was, here was a man naked on the cross. But spiritually, this was sin on the cross. Not a sinner. This was sin itself. On the cross. It says, he made him who knew no sin to be sin for us. For us. That we might become the righteousness of God. Look, look. That we who equally didn't know righteousness. Because until this time, the righteousness of men were a filthy rag. Man's righteousness was a filthy rag to God. But look, God made Jesus who knew no sin become sin. That we who didn't know righteousness should now become what? So the one who didn't know sin became sin. We, ah, we two that didn't know righteousness have become the righteousness of God. That's just... Look, become the righteousness of God where? In him. I said Christianity is all about in Christ. In him. In him. In him. If you are looking outside, you will miss it. In him. In him. That we might become the righteousness of God in him. Put the, the Passion Translation. Get ready. When, when I say something, I'll let you interpret so that I'll see how it will sound. Don't be tense, though. So, let, let's, before we read the scripture, I said, God made Jesus, who knew no sin, become sin for us. How will you say that? You have fait Jesus qui n'a jamais oh, connu. Please, please, take time. It's not, it's not a race. Take, you see how I'm talking? Don't worry. Don't, they, they will laugh. Don't worry. Don't, it's, it's normal. Yeah, so take time and say it's not. It's like your language. I say, I say, oh, crow is in you for your mouth. It's like when you meet a guy, he just says that he throws it on you. 
So I said, God made Jesus. So it's like it's like a reaction. Let's go. It's like a reaction. What we what we were not, what Jesus was not, he became. What we were not, we have become. And it's all because of him. So it's like this this reaction led to this this one. How do you say that? God made Jesus who knew no sin become sin. Dieu a fait Jésus Christ qui n'a jamais connu le péché pour que nous soyons la droiture de Dieu. Oh, is it your microphone doesn't your microphone doesn't sound what's happening okay you will we'll come again second corinthians chapter 5 verse 20 the passion translation it says we are ambassadors of the anointed one who carried the message of Christ to the world? You see, we are the ones taking the message to the world. Hey, what that sorry? We are not part of the world. We are in the world, but we are not of the world. So what that sorry? If you have drunk the wine of the world, start checking your heart. If you have become one with them, I said one day the devil took Jesus to the highest place and said, "Look at the glories of the world." It means the world has glories. He said, look at the glories of the world. Bow to me, fall down, and I will hand over to you. Are you not here to collect? Bow down, fall down. Je Jesus was standing there like this, saying Dubai. Jesus saw Dubai. Jesus saw Bali. Jesus saw all the nice places. Jesus saw Greece. Santorini. Jesus saw all the glorious and the wonderful things in the world. You see, the devil did that to see whether Jesus will still remember the word of the Father. Whether he will stick to what he is seeing. If you have become one with the world, wake up. Yes, sir. Wake up. We are ambassadors. You see, it's, 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 it's unusual to be an ambassador and not to be doing your work. Ah, in your embassy, if they, if they find out, they have a way of finding out whether the ambassador is at post, right? And they have a way of knowing whether he's working. If, if you are not working for a long time, what do you think will happen? They will demote you and bring another person. Because there are people waiting in line to come. You know, that one is political. Even if you are even working, because somebody is saying, hey, I'm checking internet. And I'm checking And now you are not working. Hey, when you are working, they are waiting. There are some people cutting your legs. You see, it's unusual to be an ambassador and not to go about promoting the interest of your home country. It's unusual. You see them in Ghana. They try to do Ghanaian and this partnership. They try to do this. Let's partner with the government to do this. What are they doing? They are promoting the interests of what? Their home country of their, or their home government. It's unusual to be a Christian and just be, be an ambassador and just be a Sunday Christian. When they talk, you say you are not part of the evangelism team. You are not part of the social and so team. Some people just come to church like red, go green. Yeah, it's not part of anything. He doesn't want to join anything. He's just there. He's just there. Oh, you, I'm, I'm, I believe in Jesus. But look at who we are. It's not say some of you are ambassadors. The, the Bible didn't say some of you are ambassadors of that. It said we are, all of us. So you, you, when you check your heart, it's eight months now, we are in August. How much of the interest of your home government have you promoted? How much? You, you, this is personal, you know, nobody will give you a microphone and ask you, is it true, is it true? The Lord knows everybody. If you are promoting, you say, I'm not part of them, I'm the cool type. You don't know. A day will come. That's why Jesus will come again. A day will come. He will know that we will know those who were really doing the work and those who were not. Because they'll say to some of them in front of all of us, Go, oh, good and faithful servant. Some of them today say, say, Pass. You know, graduations. It's not everybody who shakes the VC. Some of them, the VC will just sit down and watch. You just go. You just say, Oh, miss my baby. You. <laughs> and those ones, the way they make noise. Those are the people who come and their graduation party, they can the whole village can come. Because perhaps the whole village they don't know what what they really got, so they just say, "Hey, oh, graduate, and they will, hey, and let me see, hey, hey." 
they can tell the mother, the mother will go and tell the whole village. Say, ah, and there. And there they bring they bring two buses. They bring two buses. Wait, a covers. We reverse. And then some will even so a shadow, a dress for graduation to match the hey. Those ones, but it's a different ball game. It's a different ball game. And then there are there are those who get the first class. Even the first class, there's somebody who will be chosen to read the speech. There'll be somebody, the valid Victorian, he will read the speech. So when on that day when Jesus comes, we'll see those who get the pass. They say, Oh, me, I'll get at least I'm still in heaven. And don't worry, you you'll be part of those who be under people. They say, oh, yeah, oh, co -co -co pass. Pass. And there will be some people, some of them we never saw on social media. Some too we saw on social media, people were insulting them. Oh, were well, you fake? Or you fake, and you will see Jesus Ghani Ghani saying, Ah, good. And then all of us will be clapping for them. Then in your heart, ah, I wish I could come again. Say, say we came to this world to promote the kingdom of heaven. That's God's plan for us. It's not to come and sell so many water bottles at Adenta. You see, it's good to do business. It's good, though. It's good, though. So I always say that what you do is secondary to who you are. So says, we are ambassadors of the anointed one who carry the message of Christ to the world as though God were tenderly pleading with them directly through our lips. So the master wants to use your body to read the world. He wants to use your body to read the world. He's pleading directly to them through our lips. So we tenderly plead with you on Christ's behalf. Turn back to God and be reconciled to him. Verse 21. For God made the only one who did not know sin to become sin for us, so that we who did not know righteousness might become the righteousness of God through our union with him. So in the gospel, you see that, ah, we are righteous. We have received the righteousness of God because of what? Our union with Jesus. And because what? He became sin for us. So he, he took our place. We have taken his place. Simple and short. Simple and short. He took our place. We have taken his place. The loss of Moses demands righteousness from you. You have to be this. You have to be this. Thou shalt not. Thou shalt not. Thou shalt not. Thou shalt not. Be holy. Thou shalt it demands righteousness from you. But the gospel supplies righteousness to you. The gospel gives you righteousness. The gospel supplies righteousness to you. Put just verse 21 message. The gospel supplies righteousness. Look at the message Bible. Or give 20 since we are reading 20 and 21. Just give 20. We are Christ's representatives. Hey, so in that your workplace, in that your house, if you are if you are watching online, wherever you are, is it you are Christ's representative? So you ask yourself, Am I representing him well? Reps don't hide. They say rep. If you are rep, you don't hide. You let them know you are a rep. Yeah, you let them know you are a rep. Look, we are Christ's representatives. God uses us to persuade men and women to drop their differences and enter into God's work. God uses us to persuade men and women to drop their differences. So it's like, ah, forget about the issues and come. God wants you. God uses us to persuade men and women to drop their differences and enter into God's work. Drop your differences and do what? Yeah. Of making things right with them. God's work of what? Making things right with them. That's God's work. God, God wants to be right with all men. It's God's work. You see why I always say salvation is God's work from start to finish. All we do is to enter into the work. 
It says, enter the work. God's work, not your work. Of making things right between them and uh, between them. It says, we are speaking for Christ himself now. Become friends with God. He's already a friend with you. See, this is where we go. We go out and tell the people, tell it, become a friend of God. He is already what? A friend with you. So, God is not angry. Religion says God is angry. And he's cooling his anger with the blood of Jesus in bottles. Like Sobolo. When he's annoyed, I say, ah, the blood, the blood, the blood. It's not like that. You see, he's already a friend with you. Say, become a friend. So, the issue is now, you come in. He's okay with you. Come in. Look at verse 21. How? You say, in Christ. He said, you ask, how? He said, in Christ. Become a friend of God. How? In Christ. So, in, you can't be in Christ and be thinking, oh, God doesn't like me. God does you see. How? You say, in Christ. God put the wrong on him who never did anything wrong so we could be put right with God. The one who didn't do anything wrong. The one who didn't do anything wrong. God put the wrong on him. So that what? Oh, can we read together? God put the wrong on him who never did anything wrong so we could be put right with God. So do you reckon that God has put wrong on Jesus? Yes, sir. Have you believed it? Yes, sir. So are you right with God or not? I'm right with God, sir. You see? This is why we are always teaching the gospel. Always teaching. Because the Bible assures us that the devil is always roaming. If you don't know these things, every day you think, oh, today I'm a friend of God. Tomorrow I'm not. Oh, today, yesterday I felt more friendly, Papa. Oh, today. Oh. So guess let's go, let's go. So you feel today I'm a friend of God. If you don't know these things I'm saying, today you feel you are, you are more on friendly terms with God. I'll take my time. Don't worry. Just say, say, say. If you don't know what I'm saying, you feel sometimes you are more on a friendly term with God. If you don't know what I'm saying, sometimes you feel you are more on a friendly term with God. Sometimes Parfois, you feel you are closer. Vous sentez, vous êtes proche de Dieu. Other times you feel oh you are far away. Mais quelquefois vous vous sentez que vous êtes. But it is not like that. Mais ce n'est pas comme ça. The Bible says. La Bible dit. God put the wrong on Jesus. Dieu a chargé Jésus Christ. Who never did anything wrong. Qui n'a jamais connu le péché. So we could be put right with God. Pour que nous soyons pour que nous soyons d'amis avec Dieu. So if you reckon that Jesus carried every wrong. Si vous considérez que Jésus Christ and a, you have believed it, et que vous avez cru, then also reckon donc, that you are put right with God. Donc vous allez savoir que. Okay. So donc, the gospel reveals God's righteousness. Righteousness is what being made right with God. Le gospel révèle. Le gospel révèle la justice de Dieu. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It's not to you. <laughs> you yeah, yeah, it's working. Don't worry. You take time. Just don't worry. Say it here. You are an asset. For, uh, so take time. You want to translate that one too? You want to translate take time. <laughs> so righteousness means to be what? Put right with God. La justice, ça veut dire que vous êtes ami avec Dieu. Righteousness means be, being put right with God. La justice, ça veut dire que vous êtes ami avec Dieu. It, it is not your, your dressing. Ça n'est rien à voir. La, it's not your looks. C'est pas. Ça n'est rien à voir avec la These things are good. Ces choses c'est bon. But righteousness means to be put right with God. Mais la justice veut dire que vous êtes ami let's, avec let's Dieu. Let's look at Romans. Regardons Romains. Romans chapter 5 verse 1. Chapitre 5 verset 1. Before that, Romans chapter 4 verse 1. Avant ça, Romans, Romans chapitre 4. Romans chapter 4 verse 1. Let's, let's read the Passion Translation. Lisons le Passion Translation. Romans chapter 4 verse 1. Romans 4 verse 1. Let me use Abraham as an example. 
it is clear that humanly speaking, he was the founder of Judaism. So Paul is the one writing. He's writing to the church in Rome. He says, let me use Abraham as an example. It is clear that humanly speaking, he was the founder of Judaism. What was his experience of being made right with, with God? He's now about to talk about Abraham. Verse 2. Was it by his good works of keeping the law? No. For if it was by the things he did, he would have something to boast about. But no one boasts before God. He said if Abraham was put right because of what he did, he would have something to, what? to boast about. But, but no one boasts before God. No one. No one. That's what is by grace. No one boasts before God. No one boasts before God. Look at verse 3. Today my translator is doing one or two things. Listen, 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 listen. When I'm reading the scripture, don't translate. <laughs> that one day. But when I'm talking normal, try and translate. Don't worry. Today is the first day. You'll get it. You'll get it. I believe in you. Verse 3. Listen to what the scriptures say. Because Abraham believed God's words, his faith transferred God's righteousness into his account. Because Abraham did what? Believed God's words. His faith transferred. So how do we become righteous? How do we become righteous? How do we become righteous? Comment être justice? By believing God's word. À travers la croyance en, en la parole de Dieu. Righteousness comes by faith. La, la justice de Dieu vient avec la foi. Says, his faith transferred God's righteousness. Sa, sa foi a, par sa foi, il a eu la justice de Dieu. Into his account. Dans son compte. It's amazing. C'est très amazing. It's amazing. C'est super. It's amazing. C'est super. His faith transferred God's righteousness. Par It means foi, you can become righteous by faith. Ça veut, dire, vous, ça veut dire vous pouvez être Now, la justice de Dieu. Now, listen to this. If Abraham, do you know si we Abraham, are the seed of Abraham? That's what the Bible says. Êtes, we are le... the seed of Abraham. If Abraham became righteous by faith. Si Abraham a été la justice de Dieu par sa foi. If Abraham became righteous by faith, si Abraham a été considéré que la, la justice de Dieu par how can the seed become righteous by works? If Abraham, who is our father, and we are his seed, si Abraham qui est notre père et vous êtes son fils, even him, même lui, became righteous a été devenu la by justice faith. par sa foi. How can we? Comment nous, who are his seed, qui sont, comment nous qui sont des enfants de Abraham, become righteous by works. Devenu la justice avec. It doesn't add up. Ce n'est pas comme ça. It doesn't add up. Non, ce n'est pas comme ça. <laughs> ce n'est pas comme ça. Ce n'est pas comme ça. It doesn't add up. Ça ne marche pas comme ça. This is the first time I'm preaching with a translator. So, but we'll get it. Don't worry. If you want to go ahead, you have to start doing things ahead. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I won't wait. When, when there are 10,000 people in a crusade and I say, come and translate, that day you may urinate on yourself. <laughs> but now you will get it. You see, in ministry, you give people opportunity. You give them opportunity to sell. Give them opportunity to sell. When you get the opportunity, you grab it with two hands and you sell. He says, listen to what the scripture says. Because Abraham believed God's word, he transferred God's righteousness into his account. Verse 4. When people work, they earn wages. Most of us are working here. Beaucoup de nous travaillons ici. Most of us are working. Beaucoup de nous travaillons ici. Tomorrow is Monday. Demain, c'est lundi. Another week. Une autre semaine. You will go to work. Vous irez au travail. July has ended, so some of us have been paid. July is finished. On a été payé. Elsewhere, maybe two weeks into the month, your salary will come for July. Mais quelquefois, on n'a pas encore été payé. When your salary comes, 
si vous recevez it is not a favor your boss is doing you ce n'est pas une faveur it's not a favor ce n'est pas un service because you have worked for it parce que vous avez travaillé you have worked for it vous avez travaillé pour ça the whole month you have dedicated your time your energy your effort your brain mois, power tous les mois vous avez travaillé avec votre effort And at the end of the month, you are paid. Et à la fin du mois, vous avez été payé. You are paid. Your salary is not free. It's not. You are not just there. They say, "Come and collect salary, 2,000 CD." Votre salaire n'est pas gratuit. They even negotiate with you. On a été, on a négocié avec During vous. During the interview, how much will you pay? How much? Pendant l'interview, pendant notre train, combien vous allez prendre? When people work, they earn wages. Si Some people even are paid weekly, depending on the kind of work they do. So it's, it's a wage. It's not a salary. It's si a wage. Si des gens travaillent et reçoivent les salaires ce n'est pas un service de gratuitement for some places people living abroad some are paid two weeks two weeks some to one week one depending on the work and how you agree with them à quelque part des gens qui travaillent ils travaillent une semaine deux semaines ça dépend de où de là où vous travaillez it can be considered a free gift the wage the salary it can't be considered a free gift le salaire n'est pas un gratuit un, pas un, un cadeau because they end it parce que ils ont travaillé pour ça verse 5 verset 5 but no one earns god's righteousness you see, this, this is the truth of the scriptures no one no one you can't say you are not part on ne travaille pas no pour one. la justice de dieu you can't say you are not part vous pouvez dire que vous êtes vous n'êtes pas parti No one earns God's righteousness. Personne ne travaille pour la justice. Oh, this year I want to be righteous, Papa. Cette année, je vais être la justice. Oh, this year. Oh, cette année. Oh, this year. Oh, cette année. Oh, this year. Oh, cette année. I have set my heart. Comment je suis vraiment, vraiment. I want to be righteous. Je vais être la justice de Dieu. Then I ask you. Donc je vous demande. How do you become righteous? Comment être la justice de Dieu? So I have to fast. Oh, je dois jeûner. I have to fast and pray. Je dois jeûner et prier. I, I have to really do so much. Je dois vraiment vraiment faire beaucoup. I don't have to sleep. Je, je ne dois pas dormir. Those days when 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 I used to minister to people with oil. Auparavant, quand je ministérais avec loin. I don't use the normal oil. Moi, j'utilise pas le loin le mal. Si vous savez, vous savez. Very expensive. Vraiment vraiment cher. The body is yes, not expensive. The body is not cheap. The body is not cheap. Body is not expensive. No, people will buy it and still complain that hey, body is very expensive. Des gens achètent le body et ils plaignent, ils se plaignent que c'est cher. Those days, auparavant, those days, auparavant, the oils I was using, loin que j'utilisais, Charlie, very expensive and it smells so nice. C'est vraiment vraiment cher. Mais les goûts, when I use that oil on you. Et ça sent bon. Donc si j'utilise sur vous. Three days, cry to still. If if you remember, three days. Vous allez it's like sentir, perfume. Trois jours, vous allez sentir quand même parfum. It's like perfume. C'est so quand même parfum. It, it, when I take the oil, si je grossois le, I will become righteous. Je serai le, la, la justice de Dieu. No, he says. No. No one ends God's righteousness. Personne ne travaille pour la justice de Dieu. No one ends it. Personne ne travaille it pas. It can only be transferred. Ça peut, we, ça peut être considéré when we no longer rely si vous n'êtes plus on our own work si vous, si vous n'êtes plus en confiance dans nos travaux so when you stop working si vous, si vous and start relying si vous arrêtez de travail on god what happens you receive his righteousness vous you recevez la justice de dieu you are not only some people. you are rather listening to the translation and not listening to the message it's like you're going to check something new so you are listening you are rather focusing the one on the one who is translating to see whether he's getting the être correct vous focalisez sur le sur le traducteur oh today two people are speaking so it's kind of confusing a bit je dis deux personnes parlent donc c'est c'est confus get used to it soyez habitué soyez habitué soyez habitué alléluia alléluia get used to it. Soyez it habitué. No one ends God's righteousness. Personne ne travaille pour la justice de Dieu. It ça can only être, be transferred. Ça peut être seulement considéré transféré. When we no longer rely on our own works. Si vous n'avez plus confiance en notre travaux. But believe in the one. Mais croyez en lui. Who powerfully declares the ungodly. Qui est puissamment déclare le, le la personne qui fait le droit to be righteous in his eyes d'être la justice aux yeux de dieu look he, the one who believe 
but believe in the one who powerfully declares the ungodly to be righteous in his eyes what in his eyes i think some weeks ago or last week in his eyes la semaine passée on a dit dieu in his eyes he declares them dans les yeux if god is declaring somebody righteous what's your problem si dieu déclare quelqu'un gratuit what's your problem c'est quoi votre problème righteousness doesn't come by what you do la justice de dieu ne vient pas avec ce que vous faites Righteousness doesn't come by what you Ça do. ne vient pas avec ce que vous faites. Righteousness comes by relying on God. Ça vient avec la confiance en Dieu. It comes by believing in God. Ça vient avec la croyance en Dieu. When you believe in God, you receive righteousness. Si vous croyez en Dieu, vous recevez la justice. You receive righteousness vous when you believe in God. la justice si vous croyez en Dieu. Look at it, look at it. Regardons. It is faith that transfers God's righteousness into your account. C'est la foi qui transfère la justice faith. de Dieu. It is faith. C'est la foi that transfers God's righteousness que, into your account. Que transfère la droiture de Dieu en votre compte. It is faith. C'est la foi. If you try to relate to God by works, you you will be frustrated. Si vous si vous essayez de travailler, vous êtes frustré. If you try to relate to God by your works, by what you can do, you will be frustrated. Vous, vous serez vous serez si vous vous travaillez pour la justice de Dieu. There are many people eh, who have been in church for a long time. Il y a beaucoup de gens qui sont à l'église pour longtemps. Sometimes I meet some of them they say man of God I've been around for a long time. Parfois je rencontre quelques gens, je dis I've been around for a long time. Parce que je serai vraiment longtemps. I go to church I'm, I'm okay like Je vais à l'église, je suis OK mais dans mon mon cœur in my heart I'm dans mon cœur, je suis confus. The more I go to church, the more frustrated I become. Plus je vais à l'église, plus je serai confus. This is your message. Votre message. I told you first time I preached the gospel somewhere. Je vous ai dit la première fois que je prêchais la, le gospel. Our secretary was in front. Votre secrétaire était en I devant. I preached the word for about one hour or so. Je prêchais le, le parole. I saw goosebumps all over, over her body. Il a été surpris. She said, "Hey, what message is this?" Elle a dit, "Hey, quel message?" Ma sorry, ah. Uh, J'allais à l'église à kind of message is this? Quel genre de message comme ça? Hey! Hey! You mean God loves me like this? Vous voulez dire que Dieu m'aime comme ça? Another time I was preaching on campus. Une autre fois je prêchais au campus. Somebody was weeping. Yeah, quelqu'un pleurait. <laughs> this man I preached the gospel to him he said he said he said it's a man of God. C'est un j'ai prêché le gospel à lui, il dit pasteur. Man of God. Pasteur. This word you are preaching. Cette parole que vous prêchez. I don't know. Je ne sais pas. The thing has become so real to me in my heart. I don't know. This thing is the truth. Ça devient réel pour This moi. One, Ça c'est remember? la réalité. <laughs> vous vous souvenez? There are people we can we can go and point to. Il y a des gens qu'on fait, on, on peut montrer. Du... And God is helping us. This is the Et truth. Et Dieu aime. C'est la. Your faith. You see, it is faith. C'est la foi. That transfers God's righteousness into your account qui transférer la justice de Dieu en votre compte. It is faith. C'est par la foi. You become righteous by faith. Vous devenez la justice de Dieu par la you foi. See, remember the Bible says without faith. Souvenez-vous sans foi? It's impossible to please C'est God. impossible de so plaire Dieu. Why do you want to use another method? Donc pourquoi vous vous voulez utiliser une autre méthode? If it is God. Si c'est Dieu by faith. C'est par la foi. If it is God. Si c'est Dieu, it is by faith. C'est par la foi. If it if it is God. Si c'est Dieu, faith has to be involved. C'est par la foi. Faith has to be involved. C'est par la so foi. It is look, it is faith that transfers God's righteousness into your account. So in the gospel you see that ah, dans le gospel, this is God's righteousness. Dans le gospel vous voyez que this c'est la justice. C'est c'est la justice de Dieu. Let's let's continue. Continue. Verse 6. Verse 6. Even King David himself speaks to us. So David. Even King David himself speaks to us regarding the complete wholeness that comes inside a person when God's powerful declaration of righteousness is heard over our life. Apart from our works, God's work is enough. When they say apart from our work, it means that it means that without our works quand on dit à part de nos actions ça veut dire sans nos actions it means god's work alone is enough l'action de dieu ça suffit apart means without our works à part veut dire sans nos actions 
Apart from our works. À part de nos actions. God's work is enough. La, le travail And what is God's work? suffit. Et qu'est-ce que le travail de Dieu? What is God's work? Remember, we just read a verse. He said, "Who enter God's work of making men right with Himself?" We, we uh, just, we just read it this morning. On a déjà, on a déjà considéré. What is that? We just read it. Be good students of the Bible. Soyez That's d'être how étudiants de la Bible. To and fro in this perverse world. Comme ça, vous ne pouvez pas être confus. When you learn the word, sometimes intentionally recite the scriptures. Si vous apprenez la parole. Intentionally. Have you noticed that sometimes you can take your Bible? Est-ce que vous avez reconnu que parfois vous tenez vos, votre Bible? You want to look at one verse. Vous voulez regarder un verset. As you are looking. Comme vous regardez. Sometimes it's check your WhatsApp. Quelque chose dit votre WhatsApp. Check your WhatsApp. Regardez it's votre like WhatsApp. It's a fight. C'est comme un combat. It's a fight. C'est comme un combat. You take your Bible again. Vous prenez votre Bible encore. By the time encore. you see you are on Twitter or Facebook. Et vous serez en Twitter. You come back Facebook. again. Vous revenez encore. Check the verse. Oh. Cherchez le verset. Oh. This verse. Ah. Le verset. It can't go. It can't go. Another time. Ça peut pas entrer une autre fois. Then you pause and do something else. It's a vous fight of faith. Vous faites quelque Sometimes chose d'autre. Deliberately sit down and say, I will chew these scriptures. I will chew it. Donc il faut faire l'attention. Faire l'attention de mémoriser le verset. I will chew it. God's work is enough. Le verse travail seven. de Dieu c'est suffit. Verse seven. Verse 7. How do you say verse 7? Verse 7. Yeah. Speak boldly. Or speak, hold the microphone and speak boldly. Don't worry, nobody will do anything yes, sir. to you. God has men in the city. <laughs> Not even a hair of your head <laughs> could be touched. Here is what here is what King David says. So he's he's going to quote what? A psalm. He's going to quote a psalm. Il va, il va répéter le psalm. He's going to quote a psalm, and he's quoting it. So he says, "What happy fulfillment is ahead for those who whose rebellion has been forgiven and whose sins are covered by blood?" This is what King David said. You see, Qu'est-ce in their dit? time, remember last week. Dans le, dans le temps. Remember last week. Souvenez-vous la semaine passée. I said that. Je dis que. In their time. Dans Jesus leur temps. Jesus was a promise to them. Jésus a été un promis pour eux. So they were always looking. Ah, when is the Messiah coming? Donc ils étaient patients avec le Messiah. When is the Messiah coming? Le Messiah revient quand? Oh, when is the Messiah coming? Le Messie, il But il in our quand. time, mais dans notre temps, is a reality. C'est la réalité. He has come and gone. Il he est venu come. et il est parti. Is a reality. C'est la that réalité. That's why I said the two times don't match. C'est It's not everything dis, there. That's for us. C'est pour ça que je dis le, le deux temps, ce n'est pas. So the Bible said they, they long they long to be part of us. La Bible dit que ils ont entendu pour être avec nous. They long to be part of us. Ils ont entendu pour être avec nous. It was the cry of their heart. C'était oh, c'était leur désir en cœur. Those days will be glorious. Ce temps seront It was the cry of their heart. C'était le, so the, le the, désir the de leur cœur. About David. La Bible dit de Because David. Because in their time. Parce que dans leur temps. When sins have to be forgiven you bring your animal. Pour être pardonné vous devez and avoir un animal always, et c'était tout le temps always, c'était tout le temps always, c'était tout le temps time, tout le temps you sacrifice your animal vous sacrifiez un animal one day david sat down and said ah blessed un is jour, the one who sins are not remembered again un jour david a dit heureux à celui qui a été pardonné avec and dieu who sins and unrighteousness is covered by blood et son péché a été couvert you see so that he doesn't have to be offering, offering 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 pour que ça ne soit pas so this is this what happy fulfillment is ahead for those whose rebellion has been forgiven and whose sins are covered by blood verse 8 c'est oui i think he quoted psalm 32 also can we have psalm 32 il a il Psalm-32. a répété quelque chose he, he so, just quoted some, that's why he's asking david said oui. so it's psalm 32. 32 let's have it psalm 32 la somme 32 psalm 32 la somme chapitre 32 psalm 32 please s'il vous plaît somme 32 so this is psalm 32 this is what david wrote voilà le somme blessed is the man to whom the lord does not impute iniquity and in whose spirit there is no deceit verse 3 Verset 3. Okay, that's that's just verse 2 he quoted. Blessed is the one whose sins 
Heureux l'homme que le Seigneur ne traite pas en coupable. C'est super. Regardons la passion. Culte pour aujourd'hui, c'est différent. Vous serez habitué. Très bientôt, vous serez habitué. Pour l'instant, sans la loi, vous n'êtes pas pardonné. Under the law, your sin was forgiven until the next annual sacrifice. Sous la loi, vous êtes pardonné jusqu'à ce que le, le, le sacrifice qui vient encore. So the Bible said once a year, Donc, dit ce, the une fois par jour, le high priest entre dans, 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 dans le holy place. Excusez-moi. The high priest will go to the, the, the holy place with the blood of animals avec once le sang, a year. Avec le sang des animaux, le priest entre. So once a year, every Donc, year. une fois par une année. Aside that, there were daily offerings. Après ça, des sacrifices de chaque jour. Weekly offerings. Et les sacrifices de semaine. And monthly offerings. La, les sacrifices de mois. Imagine all these offerings. Imaginons every time, tous every ces time. Les sacrifices, tous ces and sacrifices. Jesus came one touch, per, bah, Jésus Christ finished. est venu juste une fois et c'était fini. It is finished. Et c'était fini. Look, back, back to what we are reading. Revenons à ce que nous faisons. Back to what we are reading. Revenons à ce que nous faisons. We are reading Romans chapter four, eh? Nous lisons le Romain chapitre 4. What progress comes to them when they hear the Lord speak over them? I will never hold your sins against you. The Lord is the one saying it to. The Lord says what? I will never. The Lord says I will never hold your sins against you. Le Seigneur dit vous ne serez pas coupable. Avec I would péché. never hold your sins against you. Vous ne serez pas coupable avec votre so péché. In the gospel, Donc dans le gospel, we see God's righteousness voyons la droiture de Dieu a été transférée à notre because compte of our faith in Jesus. parce que c'est à cause de notre foi en Dieu. Souvenez-vous, la Bible dit que c'est par la foi que la justice de Dieu soit transférée. C'est simple. Verset 9. Verset 9. Look, he's, he's bringing Abraham in so he can explain to everybody. Il explique Abraham pour qu'il explique pour tout. Faith was credited to Abraham as God's righteousness. Verse, verse 10. Verse 10. How did he receive this gift of righteousness? Righteousness is what? It's a gift. La, la justice c'est galop. Remember he gave an analogy about Souvenez working. Vous, il a donné un exemple d'un travail. Dans verset 2, dans verset 2. He gave an example that when you work, what you receive is a wage, it's not a free gift, remember. Now he says righteousness is a free gift. Il nous a donné un exemple que si vous travaillez, ce que vous recevez, ce n'est pas un gratuit, ce n'est pas un cadeau, mais c'est un salaire. Maintenant, il nous donne encore un exemple. Remember, when it's a wage, it means you have worked for it. It's so you have, vous, you have earned it. Souvenez-vous, si c'est un salaire, ça veut dire que vous avez travaillé pour ça. So you have earned it if it's a wage. Vous it's not a favor. Si un salaire, ce n'est pas un gratuit. But he says, he says, if he earned it, then he could have something to boast about before God. Remember. Il, but he says, but no one can boast before God. Il peut se vanter devant, il peut se vanter devant quelqu'un si il a reçu un salaire. Now he's asking, how did he receive this gift of right? So he tells you, righteousness is a gift. Donc forcément, la justice de Dieu c'est un cadeau. When you receive a gift, si vous recevez un cadeau, qu'est-ce que vous faites? You accept and enjoy it. Vous acceptez 
et vous en profitez. If today were your birthday, si aujourd'hui c'est votre anniversaire, and your friend says, oh, Charlie, today is your birthday. Charlie, let's go and enjoy some papaya. Et votre ami dit, oh, aujourd'hui c'est votre anniversaire. Alors, you have not earned it. Vous n'avez pas reçu. Or your friend says, ah, Charlie, today is your birthday. Oh, collect this chocolate. Votre ami dit, aujourd'hui c'est votre it's anniversaire. It's a gift. Donc, prenez ça, c'est un cadeau. So, for a gift, you either receive that you either accept or reject it. Pour un cadeau, soit vous recevez, soit vous rejetez. When you choose to accept it, si vous choisissez de accepter, you enjoy it. You vous en profitez. So he says, righteousness is equally what a gift. Donc la justice c'est également un cadeau. On ne peut rien faire pour ça. We could never do anything for it. On ne peut rien faire pour ça. We could never do anything. On ne peut rien faire pour ça. We could never. On ne peut rien it's faire. a free gift of God. C'est un cadeau gratuitement free donné gift. de Dieu. And we received this gift by faith in Jesus. Et nous avons reçu ce cadeau par Jésus Christ. Look, how did Abraham receive this gift of righteousness? Listen, Paul is. You see, in those days, Écoutons. and you can't just walk to them and tell them that this is it. So you have to use a, a wise way so that they themselves will say, Ah, it's true. Auparavant, vous ne pouvez pas expliquer directement que voilà. So he says, was he circumcised at the time God accepted him? Or was he still uncircumcised? Clearly, he was an uncircumcised Gentile. Abraham was not a Jew. Abraham n'a été pas un Juif. Do you know that Abraham was not a Jew? Ça veut dire Abraham n'est pas un Juif. This, maybe somebody doesn't know. Pastor how? Uh, he lived before, it was his, 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 his son, his grandson. C'est le fils d'Abraham qui est Jacob. Abraham gave birth to Isaac. Isaac gave birth to Jacob. Il a donné au monde And out of Jacob, Isaac. the twelve tribes came. So they were the Jewish people. But he, he lived ahead before that time. So he was never a Jew. It means he, he didn't have any law. Pour... Il n'était jamais un juif. You see, and the, the Bible takes us back to that, that state and it says we are Abraham's seed. It means we... <laughs> La Bible a utilisé l'exemple d'Abraham pour nous dire qu'on est, on est des, euh, so, des enfants d'Abraham. Abraham was not a Jew. Abraham n'était pas un and juif. And when God came to him, he was, he was not circumcised. Si Dieu est venu no circumcision. approche lui, il n'était pas circoncis. So he was an uncircumcised Gentile when God said this of him. Verse 11. Verse 11. It was later that he received the external sign of circumcision as a seal to confirm that God had already transferred his righteousness to him by faith. So the circumcision came as what? A seal. Mm -hmm. As a sign. The circumstance vient comme un signe. That God had transferred his righteousness to Abraham. Que Dieu a transféré sa justice à Abraham. While he was still uncircumcised. So now, this Donc, qualifies him to be the father of all who believe among the non-Jewish people. So Abraham, long and short of what we are saying. Hey, Pastor, what have you been saying plainly like this? Abraham became righteous by faith. En conclusion, Abraham a été la justice de Dieu par sa foi. Dieu a Abraham, Abraham believed this. Dieu a said, ah, parlé à Abraham, guy. Abraham a cru, il a dit, ah, c'est ma justice. And the Bible says we are his seed. So it means we dit, operate on the same tangent of faith. La Bible dit, on est enfant de Dieu. Let's read the message Bible from the beginning to this verse. From the beginning, message, please. Are you enjoying the service? Du or the translation is, is distracting your attention. I don't worry. It is well. The gospel go. Ava, the gospel do how, So how do we fit what we know of Abraham, our first father in the faith, into this new way of looking at things? It's, it's a new way of looking at things. Verse 2. If Abraham, by what he did for God, got God to approve him, he will certainly have taken credit for it. But the story we are giving is a God story, not an Abraham story. It means the story is about what? It's about God doing his thing. It is God's story. Il s'agit de l'histoire de Dieu. Not an Abraham story. What this means is that it is God doing the work. Ce que cela veut dire, c'est que c'est Dieu qui fait le travail. Not Abraham doing the work. Abraham qui travaille. Abraham only believed God. Abraham, il a seulement cru en Dieu. That's all. Verse, verse three. Tout. Verse three. What we read in Scripture is Abraham entered into what God was doing for him. 
and that was the turning point. <laughs> the turning point is entering into what God is doing. Ce qui a changé est de d'entrer de ce que Dieu fait. I said, this is why many are frustrated. Beaucoup de gens they are trying frustrés. to serve God by their works. They are trying Ils to serve God by what they can do. De ce qu'ils font faire. So righteousness, which is a gift, they Donc, are trying to work for it, so it, it will become a reward. Look at it. He trusted God to set right. He trusted God to set him right instead of trying to be right on his own. Can we read it together? Please, there's, there's the last part of the verse. Let's go. He trusted God to set him right instead of trying to be right. Instead of trying to be right on his own. You see, he trusted God to set him right. So being, being made right, or to be righteous is to be made right with God. And yes. all you do is to trust God. We just read that he made Jesus who knew no sin become sin. D'être là, c'est comme pour être juste avec Dieu, comme on a déjà regardé. Verse 4, please. Verse 4, s'il vous plaît. If you are a hard worker and do a good job, you deserve your pay. You deserve if some of you is 29. Parmi vous aussi c'est 29 de mois. 28. À la fin du mois. 28. De 30. Some joy be. Quelle joie. Out of nowhere. Qui vient de nulle part. Just enters your heart. Votre cœur. I know workers who literally count the days in the month. It's Les not because they love counting. C'est pas parce que ils ils it's because they know they know the motivation behind the counting. Parce que Some still do 30 days in September, April, June, and November. Y a des gens qui, qui ont tu... September. They still do that so that they can know. Hey, we are in the second week. Pour savoir, some dans Some just go one semaine. week more, one week more. Finish hard, finish hard. Encore une semaine, encore une semaine. Finissons très dur. Finish hard because they know. And some some of the the, the bosses at work. Et quelques boss au travail. They also have this this attitude. Some of them they also have this attitude they put up when it's 28, 29, 30. Years. They suddenly conduite. get annoyed. Ils se conduisent de quelques manières qui sont pas bon. They suddenly get annoyed. They are annoyed because they have to pay. Ils sont fa- They have to pay your salary, pay your SNIT, pay your allowance. Doivent payer donc ils sont. Fâchés. They know the volume of money that will leave their account, so they are just not in the mood to talk to him. When you say good morning, say what's good about the morning? Il savent beaucoup l'argent qu'ils vont payer, donc il n'est pas content. Why a hard worker? He said, if you are a hard worker and do a good job, you deserve your pay. We don't call your wages a gift. He's using this analogy to explain righteousness. Example pour expliquer justice de Dieu. Verse five. Verse. But if you see that the job is too big for you, that is something only God can do, and you trust him to do it, you could never do it for yourself, no matter how hard and long you worked. Well, that trusting him to do it is what gets you set right with God, by God. Share gift. Un cadeau. Un juste cadeau. Share gift. Cadeau. What many Christians should be receiving, they are trying to work. Ce que beaucoup de chrétiens doivent recevoir, ils travaillent pour ça. That's what they are. I said many are frustrated. C'est pour ça ils sont so confus. Are, ah, I'm trying. Donc il dit ah j'essaye. I'm trying. J'essaye. Oh, I'm trying. J'essaye. One day when we get to heaven, everything will be okay. Un jour ah. quand on est quand on est ah. en heaven, tout sera bien. I'm trying. Oh j'essaye. Oui. One day, one day I read a book by Rick Joyner. J'ai lu, j'ai lu un livre saw, de Rick Joyner. To Paul in heaven. Il a vu Apostle Paul. And he asked Celeste. him, how is death like? Il a demandé comment est la mort. He said it's like coming out of noise into peace. Il dit c'est provenu de la de la du bruit. Then he asked him, are they still preaching my message? Donc il lui demande, est-ce qu'ils ont toujours so prêché mon it. message? C'est super. My, my experience I have there when I ask the person how is death like say it's like changing your clothes. On espère c'était. Je je demande la personne comment est la mort il dit 
si vous changez des habits. Ah, ah. In heaven, God says, ah, you, you just came and you are righteous. Where are the angels? Show him, show him where the righteous places. You were already made righteous on the earth. Vous êtes déjà, vous êtes déjà la justice de Dieu en terre. You were already made righteous. Vous êtes déjà fait. That trusting him to do it is what gets you set right with God by God. Share gift. Righteousness is what? A share gift. La justice, c'est un cadeau justement. Verse, verse 6, please. Verse 6, s'il vous plaît. David confirms this way of looking at it. Saying that the one who trusts God to do the putting everything right without insisting on having a say. You see, we don't have a say. Without insisting on having a say is one fortunate man. So we are fortunate what? We are fortunate men. On a la chance. Verse, verse 7. Verse 7. Fortunate, fortunate those who fortunate those whose crimes are cutted off whose sins are wiped clean from the slate remember colossians tells us that you he, he, he clean every handwriting Le nous dit, he, against us il a, he wiped it il a fassé tous les nos oh clean me wash me with your blood wash me let me become white as oh, snow love moi what pour que je sois quels sont les, les... Lord prepare me. No, no, no. Oh, and and wash me. There are songs like that. Wash me white. Let me become like snow, and I will be white and and dien dien. All these things. Tous ces chansons. They are not, or they don't agree with the truth of the scriptures. Ils sont pas avec les écrits. See, that you feel it does not mean it is the truth. Que vous vous sentez ne veut pas dire que c'est la. I said you measure truth by the liberty it produces. On mesure la réalité avec Because la liberté qu'il donne. Said, Parce que Jésus Christ a dit. The truth and the truth will make you free. Vous so serez la réalité comes, et la réalité serait la liberté. It means when truth comes. Ça veut dire quand la réalité vient. It it liberates you. Ça vous libère. This morning, is it righteousness is a share gift. Share gift. So Ce we see it in the gospel. C'est un cadeau. On regarde ça dans le gospel. We see it in the gospel that on regarde ça ah, dans le gospel. righteousness is God's gift to us. Ah, la justice de Dieu, c'est un cadeau de Dieu pour nous. This is God giving a gift to the whole world. C'est comme si Dieu donne un cadeau pour le and monde. And what we do is what to receive it and nous have to receive it by faith in Jesus. Ce que nous faisons, c'est de recevoir et on reçoit Verse ça en, par la foi en Jésus Christ. Verset 8. Fortunate, the person against whom the Lord does not keep score. It means God has no score to veut, settle with us. Dire, Dieu n'a rien à faire avec votre péché. This thing I'm teaching you Je vous prêche. will help your prayer. It will votre help your prière. general living. Ça va aider votre... it, it gives peace to the heart. Ça la paix Knowing la God peur. has nothing against me. Avant que Dieu n'a rien contre moi. God is not mad at you. Dieu n'est pas contre votre, vous. God is mad about you. God aime. God is mad about you. God, God is madly in love with you. Le Dieu vous aime. Remember last week. Souvenez-vous la semaine passée. We are his very own. Very own. Nous very sommes own. des enfants. Fortunate. He says fortunate the person against whom the lord does not keep score we are fortunate this was david said, hey, de la look, even david david said hey that person is fortunate même this, david this, a dit this is who we are même david a dit heureux soit cet fortunate. homme c'est ce que nous sommes you see it was a prayer for them c'est un prière pour eux oh oh that person will be fortunate papa cette personne and we are, we, are, we, are, we are we are the church we are those people That person is Et all cette personne, c'est nous tous. Everybody who has believed in Jesus is that Quelqu'un qui a cru en Jésus-Christ a la chance, a cette chance. It's not okay to go to Psalm 51 of David and say, Ah! Oui, pourquoi c'est pas correct? Me not away. That de was prier, the prayer for the day. De prier la prière de David. For that time, that prayer was okay. Cette personne, Cast me not away. Okay. Take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Create in me a clean heart. Ne me, ne me renvoyez pas de votre présence. And renew a right spirit within me. Et renouvelle mon esprit. Create in me a clean heart. 
Oh Lord, oh Lord, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away. Cast me not away from thy presence, oh God. Restore unto me the joy of my salvation and renew and renew a right within some some of you never went to uh, sunday school so you are just there mm -hmm. 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 I told in 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 JSS, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. When they are singing, we'll be at the back. Qui chantait, nous sommes au fond. On on fait. And we were musically inclined to, so we 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 harmonize it for them. Et on était vraiment intéressé, donc on we fait tout know, ça pour we eux. Know, we don't know the words, on ne savait pas les paroles. We, we know the key. Mais on savait. So we are at the back. One of our teachers came and said, every Tuesday and Thursday is. Uh, uh, no, no, not worship. Patriotic songs. Le professeur un jour venu et dit chaque chaque. Patriotic songs. So they will come and sing all the. Chaque mardi. One hour. In our school, it's like it's like it's a music. <laughs> you don't know. Tuesdays and Fridays. <laughs> we went to the same school. Tuesdays and Fridays. Patriotic. Ah! And then when you come to the class, your madam is also giving it to the girl madam. Girl madam. We can sit down and the, the girl madam will say, Me tanya lo, tawa de sa, mensa tawa de sa, tanya lo, tawa de sa, watch your mensa tawa. Once you sing, you have to respond. Everybody will sit down, they will look at you. <laughs> so you just be there. They say, Tower, then we'll be, we'll be at the back. We, the band guys, we'll be at the back. The guys in the band will sing auto, sing tenor, sing bass. Tower, they saw Mensa, Tower, they saw. Tower, they saw what you mean, Sir Tower, they saw. Tower, they saw Mensa, Tower, they saw. So it's like a music school. And they will now come and bring all the songs. And there was one song like that. They'll just be singing, you don't know what they are singing, just be at Ghana, will you go ye, ni ne, ni ne, ni ne, ni ne, God, Felipe. Ni ne, ni ne, ni ne, don, don, to. And you don't remember this one. Don, don, to. Don't do you, do you, do you, do you, Ghana, Felipe, ye, ni ne, ni ne. Ni ne, don, don, to. Ni ne, don, don, to. Because we don't know the song. You just be inside. You just be in it. So you see them creating me a clean heart. It was okay for David's age, David's time. David's time, the time he lived in. Pork, c'est correct. You can see him praying here. Ah, fortunate is the person. Vous pouvez regarder qu'il priait ici. Against whom the Lord does not keep a score. Heureux, cette, heureux soit cet homme qui a été pardonné Because de Dieu. Because at that time, Parce que Ale... there was a score. On doit faire un score. That's why when Jesus came, c'est pourquoi quand je suis venu, he said he made him to become sin. Fait être un péché. Who knew no sin? Si. That's a game changer. Qui a changé? C'est ce qui a changé le jeu. Have you heard somebody say, "For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of His grace"? You can of the glory of God, verse three twenty three, Romans three twenty three. Romans chapitre trois verset trente trois. They just quote the scripture. They don't end it. Ils reprennent l'écriture. Mais il n'arrête pas. When I'll go for, when I'll go for those times, we'll go to the hall and say, ah, Quand je suis allé prêcher sin, le gospel, il dit, for all have sinned, brothers and sisters, for all have sinned and fall short. Pour tout le monde qui a péché, 
contre of the Dieu. Glory of God. But see, the verse doesn't even end. No, sir. It has a comma. Mm. Unless, are you the ones who have written it there like that? <laughs> <laughs> so that we go outside and go and check. Because sometimes when you are teaching the truth, I said the lie can be so popular that when the truth comes, they say, hey, you are controversial. Mm. That's how Jesus looked. They, are cont- yeah. they even say, hey, you, you are a small boy. What do you know? Come out, hey. The patwa guys will say, Wolan, Wolan. What it means, come talanku. For all have sinned, please look here, and fall short of the glory of God. Is it full stop? No, sir. Comma, verse 20. It means something continued. Being justified freely by his grace. So everybody was in that state, but now this is what has happened. Tout le monde était comme ça, mais maintenant on a été juste. Being justified freely by his grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. So everybody was in that falling state. But now justification ça. has come. Maintenant, through the redemption that is in Jesus. Par la redemption qui est en Christ. So if I just go, for all, you see, what, you must intentionally study the scriptures and be teachable. Vous avez à avoir l'intention de... Be de... teachable. Be teachable. Oh, me, I know it. Me, I know it. Be teachable. Yes, Sit down and be taught. Yes, sir. Calmez-vous. Back to what we are, we are looking at. I'm closing soon. So, creating me a clean heart. I'm 51. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. The one who said that, it was okay at that time. That time, that's a prayer. Oh, God, help me. Oh, God. Oh, creating me a clean heart. But now, that person, oh, fortunate, the person against whom the Lord does not keep a score. And we are the fortunate people he's talking about. We are the fortunate people. Because this time, he himself has said, I will not keep your sins. I will not keep a score. Verse, verse 9. Do you think for a minute that this blessing is only pronounced over those who keep our religious ways and are circumcised? He's asking, do you think that is for the Jewish guys? They're religious guys. Or do you think it, it's, do you think it's possible that the blessing could be given to those who never had who never even heard of our ways, who were never brought up in the disciplines of God. We all agree, don't we, that it was by embracing what God did for him that Abraham was declared fit before God. Embracing it. And that's by faith. Next verse, please. Now think, was that declaration made before or after he was marked by the covenant right of circumcision? That's right, before he was marked. So he was, he was even a Gentile that time. Gentile guy. Il n'était pas un juif à cette époque. Verset 11. That means that he underwent circumcision as evidence and confirmation of what God had done long before to bring him into this acceptable standing with himself. So right here, also what? Acceptable standing with God. La justice, c'est la substance. Do you realize that one day the Bible said Vous souvenez que un jour la Bible dit Moses was walking one day. Moïse God chooses funny people. Le, le people with some character. Des personnes de de, de caractère vraiment différentes. One day Moses was walking in town, he saw a bush burning. But un the jour, bush Moïse, was not burning. Moïse a, a vu la forêt qui en brûle. The, the bush was not burning. Il y avait un feu, mais il brûle pas. Moses was pas comme ça. Moïse, il a aimé comme ça. Moses was pas comme ça. So he walked there and said, "Hey, how do we do?" Minister, he approached. He was approached in the forest and said, "What is going on here?" Moses, you are going somewhere good there. Moses, he said, "Hey, Minister, he pulled me." Moses, you are going to continue. I don't know. Hey, she dance or anything. But he said, "What is going on?" Then he heard a voice. So he heard a voice. And the voice said, "Moses, the ground you are standing on, 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 the ground you are standing on." C'est la justice. It's holy ground. Saint terre de Dieu. Remove your slippers. Remove your sandals. Dégagez votre sandal. Remove your your slippers. Dégagez votre sandal. And the Bible says he also did it. Of course, that was what holy ground. Because it 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 was what holy ground. Because
what the ground didn't do anything. He said it's holy ground. La so you see, it doesn't holiness, righteousness. It doesn't come by what you do. It comes because God is there. La justice vient avec Dieu est là. God was there. You see, it was Dieu an ordinary bush, but today God was there. C'était so une forêt there. ordinaire parce que Dieu Et était là. And he said to Moses, Il a dit à Moïse, dégagez vos sandales. It is holy ground. You see, at that time you couldn't stand on the same this one with God. You are too filthy to stand. Remove your slippers. Mm. But now the Bible says that, look at this. This means that he underwent circumcision as evidence and confirmation of what God had done long before to bring him into acceptable standing. It means now we can stand. We can stand in God's presence. Maintenant, on peut être debout dans la présence Because de Dieu. Because of Jesus. À cause de à Jésus Christ. He has brought us. Il nous a envoyé dans le standard with avec lui-même. Souvenez-vous la semaine passée. Grâce à Jésus-Christ, Dieu, Dieu nous a établi dans terre solide with avec lui-même. Regarde. Bring him into acceptable standing with himself. An act of God he had embraced with his whole life. You embrace the thing. It's, that's what makes it a gift. Not a wage. Vous recevez, c'est ce qu'il fait pour, pour être un cadeau. It's a gift. Share gift. C'est un cadeau, ce pas un travail. God bless you. We'll continue again next Que Dieu week. vous bénisse. On Let's va continuer la semaine prochaine. Hallelujah. Prépare. Prépare.